Yo, what's up guys? Um it, it's been a good few months, obviously. Um a lot has changed over these past few months. Um but there's one thing that hasn't changed since October. Um a I know I mentioned this like six months ago on one video, but I'm a follower of Christ. Um I believe in Jesus. If you do not believe in Jesus, you are, you're in danger. You're, you're lost. And you got to repent and believe in the gospel, bro. And it's how you get to heaven is believing in Jesus. And I believe in Christ. And I believe what he has for me is the best plan. And, you know, that's all I really had to say about you know, my faith, my faith in God, um, and, um, I'm just gonna discuss some different topics throughout this five, six minute video, um, that was the first topic, the second topic I want to talk about is, um, I am getting baptized, I will be getting baptized May 18th at 5 p.m. Eastern, I think it's 3 p.m. Eastern or 5 p.m. Eastern, Somewhere between there, and yeah, I will be getting baptized May 18th, late at middle afternoon to late afternoon, um, and I will, yeah, I will be getting baptized. I'll be fully committing myself to Christ. Um, I I can't wait. It's gonna be amazing to kind of like have that moment with Jesus right then and there. It's going to be amazing, but, um, third thing I wanted to talk about, <laughs> you guys know I am a huge Warriors fan, I am an absolutely huge Warriors fan, but let's get to the NBA playoffs first. Um, playoffs have been very, very, very exciting, there's a lot of good series. The big shocker for me is probably the Timberwolves leading 2-0 over the Nuggets, I expected the Nuggets to tie up the series in Game 2 a couple of nights ago, but... They did not. I mean, that's the that's the biggest shocker in the playoffs for me so far. Um, Brunson is probably the most impressive player in the playoffs so far for me. It's close between Brunson and Edwards, but Brunson's got the the yeah, the edge because um, he did have like forty eight points in an elimination game, but. Um, um, the fourth topic. You guys know I am a absolutely huge Warriors fan. You guys know they got eliminated in the play-in. And not just eliminated, they got absolutely demolished in the play-in. Like, they lost by like 30 points. The main thing, we just got to rebuild this team. We got to let everybody go. I think... The number one thing, let Clay go in free agency. Just let him go. He's not good anymore. He's not nearly as good as he used to be. Two, we should let, honestly, get rid of Wiggins. Get rid of Wiggins. We should trade Wiggins for some value, maybe some picks in the future. Three, we should honestly just, just like, Rebuild. Honestly, if it's a tanking year next year, it's a tanking year. I, li I literally do not care about it. We absolutely have to be good in these next few years if we're going to get Curry another ring. Because Curry, honestly, if Curry can get another ring, he has five rings, he's honestly going to be in like the top four, top three players of all time. I mean, in that argument. But, honestly... Yeah, I mean, that's my thoughts about it. That was a terrible ending of the season. I think Kerr should be honestly fired after that. That was pathetic. I mean, it's it's been his philosophy over the past, like, three years to, like, not, like, just, like, besides 2022, Kerr has absolutely not even, like, he's been an offensive guy. I get that. Okay, you're an offensive guy. But you, like, we have to have a good defense. We were getting no stops versus the Kings. Like, absolutely zero stops. They scored 120 points in a win-or-go-home game. 
In a winner go home game, they scored 120 points. We we've got to play better defense than that. Like we we have to. We have to play better defense than that. That was a poor effort on defense. And honestly, going into this offseason, season, hopefully we get some good acquisitions. Um, in free agency, we do the right moves, and we'll be back in we'll be back in the playoffs here soon. But obviously, I mean. Yeah, it's all that's all my thoughts about the Warriors and um another topic, um I know you guys are wondering when am I gonna come back with reaction videos and stuff. Honestly I might never do them again just because of the stress that like it's not even really stressful. It's just I don't have enough storage on my phone because I record on a phone. Um, I just don't have the right equipment, I don't have, you know, the right stuff to be able to do reaction videos to sports and stuff, because all you guys are saying is just me reacting to nothing, and it's kind of like lame, I, I really don't like it, I try to turn the volume up on those reactions, but they just, like, never turned out the way I wanted them to, and... Yeah, I mean, that's that's basically all my thoughts about, you know, getting back to video, reaction videos. I'm, I'm thinking about quitting YouTube. This might be my last video, it might not, but I'm definitely just going to take a month or two off of YouTube. And from here on, probably like a month off of YouTube, see if I really want to continue doing it. Um... And just go into prayer about it, ask God about it, you know, pray, 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 um, and see what God is guiding me to, and see, um, if he really wants me to continue videos or not, I mean, I don't really know, um, wherever God's plan is, I'm going, so, um, yeah, um, anyways, um, a serious topic I wanted to talk about was I am not a normal kid or not a normal teenager. I am 16. I just turned 16 a couple weeks ago. My birthday was a couple weeks ago, but I have I have ADHD. I have autism, a little bit of autism. I have neurological problems. So, yeah, I have, like, three things that are, um, wrong with me, but, um, honestly, it's what makes me, like, special and different than others, so, honestly, God knew I could overcome it, um, from birth, so, I mean, I, I can overcome anything, um, that I can handle, so, you know, of course, that's with God by my side, but, um, yeah, um, it's about all, um, just wanted to cover those topics, talk to you guys a little bit about what I'm going to be doing in the near future, or not really what I'm going to be doing in the near future, but the events I have coming up, and, you know, I'm sitting here on my Xbox right now, but I grind some Forza, but, um, if you guys always want to add me, I will put my, um, Xbox username on my um on my YouTube so you guys can get to it and add me on Xbox but um yeah I have current gen so Xbox One S if you guys want to add me I have current gen Xbox One I'm getting a job here in a month so definitely gonna get me a next gen when I can but, um, that, that's up to God what, um, what's next in my life, and can't really plan it out, because I'm following God's plan, so. Um, yeah, it's about all, um, this last, this video has lasted more than I wanted it to, but, um, yeah, so, you guys are not gonna see me over this next month or two, I think I'm gonna take a month off, yeah. Four to five weeks off and see if I want to continue doing YouTube 
if I want to continue making videos or just quit it in general. If I do continue to make videos, it'll probably be something like preaching or um, just some Christianity stuff um, here on the channel and spreading the gospel um, and yeah, probably that and um, some wrestling stuff or yeah, um, I'm thinking about uploading videos to my YouTube channel again like those WWE 2K videos I used to do. Like, with Jason Tatum, Tyrese Maxey, and some NFL players like Brady Fields and stuff. Um, and, yeah, I'm just going to give my th quick thoughts on the NFL real quick, obviously. Um, I don't support Taylor Swift. I, I don't support any of the Chiefs. I don't, I don't support them. I hate, I, don't, I hate the Chiefs. I do not like Taylor Swift. I despise Taylor Swift, actually. I just do not like her. Because she is demonic, she performs witchcraft on stage, there is proof and evidence of it on videos all over the internet. And there's proof of lyrics too. So, yeah, I, I don't support her, I don't like the Chiefs, um, I'm an Eagles fan, I'm a diehard Eagles fan. I have a shirt on right now, it says Eagles. I have an Eagles um, uh, banner slash flag thing up on my wall, so yeah, I'm a big Eagles fan, and, um, yeah, um, that's about it, um, I hope y'all have a blessed day, I'll be back in four to five weeks to give my answer on what I'll be doing with this YouTube channel, and if I stay or not, if I quit making videos or not, so, um, yeah, have a blessed day, guys, peace.